Yeah, hi all. Quick video just showing you guys um, how I tested my thermal vacuum switch. So yeah, I've got a cup of um, hot water um, coming off the boil a few minutes ago. And what I did is I just gently pushed on this clear bit of pipe onto the middle one. And then um, when you blow through it, when, when the switch is cold, you have air coming out of the top hole here, which I think is marked, I think it's marked as um, a one on this switch. The air blows out of there nothing out of the bottom one then when you put it in hot water i literally put it in obviously in this temperature water literally for a day maybe like 10 seconds not not very long and then just blew through it and now this top one here sorry is sealed and the air flows for the bottom one here so yeah i can feel it coming through there so that's how i tested that so that, so that seems good which is cool and um yeah i've got two more switches here which i need to um test as well later on to see if they're working or not, but I'll give them a good old clean. You know, of course I could buy new ones, but if I can reuse these ones, because lots of these switches are really, really expensive, you know, so I think this is about 60 pounds for this one. I'm not sure how much these ones are. They're probably, probably quite expensive. So if I can reuse them, then that um, makes sense. Um, this one here actually comes with a, with a washer, and this one it doesn't. So when I when I put it back in again, once I've checked it, I'll probably put a bit, a bit of um, sort of sealant of some type on here, or Loctite or something. Okay, there we go. Cheers.